All right, thank you, Kerry. And uh, joining me right now is a real role model for you. I mean, what a celebrity. A celebrated actress, former Miss USA. Oh. Oh, yeah, and, and the original <laughs> Wonder Woman. Yeah. I mean, fantastic. Linda Carter, it's so good to have you thank here. Thank you it's so, so much. great. You look fabulous. Well, thank you. Yeah. I live in a wind tunnel. <laughs> you do? <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> Listen, no. 1975 is when you started Almost as what? Almost 40 years ago. And people still think of you as Wonder Woman. Yes, How do you I feel know. about that? Well, if I still look anywhere similar. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a great compliment. I'll take that, right? Yeah, I'll take it. Absolutely. <laughs> Listen, there are a lot uh, so of far, no, So far, no work done. No work done. Good. Not yet. Okay. You don't need anything. But you know what? You are a celebrity. You are a role model in many ways. And a lot of people think about that, okay? But, you know, there are ordinary people. I mean, you're, you're a mom as well, and there are people who are good mothers. I feel ordinary a lot of the time. Well, that's not a bad thing. Yeah. I mean, there, there are sisters, there are teachers, there are those people who can make a difference and be role models, which is the subject of today. How important is that, Linda? Well, for, for me, any kind of freedom in whatever mm -hmm. you do, uh, it takes discipline. And the discipline uh, to, to uh, really know what you're talking about when you try to teach your children, read a lot, really you know, get to the resources of, of sure. raising your family. And if you want to, you know, I think education, 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 yes, the so more education you can get, uh, have your children be in, uh, that will uh, dictate their success almost uh, more than anything. And you have two wonderful children. Yes. And I know how proud you are. Yes. And you're being a role model, but you also had a fabulous role model, your mom. I mean, yeah. she had a terrific influence on you, didn't she? My mother was a piece of work. <laughs> I lost her this past year oh, to Alzheimer's. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, she was, she, she used to sing and she used to dance around the house and she used to play all these albums and all these records that mm -hmm. were 75s. And we would, I would learn all these songs. Well, come to find out, I go to kindergarten or whatever, and uh, it's like, oh, do you thing on me, baby? <laughs> all this <laughs> stuff about you know, all these juke joint singers, and yeah. my my man's got a bigger thing mm -hmm. than your man does. Okay. And, and I was like, and I'm singing, singing all, that all stuff these. to you. So my influence for for my music yeah. is really uh, is really my mom, and and she she, she really went to had work. An influence uh, on you in many yeah, ways. She, I she know. She worked. Um, you know, she was a single mother, and. You know, and I have a great relationship with my father, too. That's terrific. He's still alive. He, very 92. Good. 92 and going well. And he's got a girlfriend. Well, that's wonderful. Everybody's living well. Yeah. Uh, you know, Linda, we also talk about, you know, reality mm -hmm. versus, you know, the spotlight. Because a lot of people, you know, it's okay you have a career and so forth. But the reality of life, you know, the real tangible stuff where people can say, I learned something from this role model. And a lot of young women are looking for that today. They're out there. They're still out there. If you, you ha and you have to find it, you have to have enough within yourself yeah. that you are going to go after what you want because no one is going to give it to you. I don't care if you've got wealthy parents or you've got a single, uh, you know, a mm -hmm. single parent family, uh, you're the one as an individual, whether you're five or you're 15, you have to decide and to make you. personal choices for yourself that you distance yourself from the troublemakers and you focus on what your future is going to be in Boy, your life. Boy, that's great advice. And, and you've done that, too, and you're doing it w with your family as well. Yeah. You also have a lot of excitement going on because this Friday night, mm -hmm. 730, Jazz at Lincoln Center, you're going to be performing with your all-star band. Yeah, my yeah. all-star band. Some of them are uh, uh, members of the Musicians Hall of Fame, Jazz Musicians Hall of Fame, Regular Musicians Hall of Fame, Grammy-winning songwriters at the piano. Uh, three singers and, and seven this musicians. This excites you. Yeah. Excites oh. you, right? Yes, it's great. I, I wish I could be there, but anyway, I'm going to catch you the next time that okay. you're in town, okay? Yes. Linda Carter, it's so it, wonderful to have you here. This is a great show. Thank you. I love this Come show. Come back and stay with us and a And I while. love the whole setup. You're fabulous. You're fabulous, too. Linda Carter, thank the original you. Wonder Woman. Yeah. Okay, and we'll see you Friday night at Lincoln Center. Yes, Thanks thank you. Thanks a lot. Okay. Jazz at Lincoln Center. Jazz at Lincoln Center.